Hi, I'm Mike Dowd, head professional here at Oakdale Golf and Country Club, and this is your 50 Second Fix. When it comes to the short game, a lot of times a good day around the green starts back in the fairway. Now, one of the things we do when we teach the short game is we like to say, putt whenever you can, chip if you can't putt, and pitch only if you really have to. The reason being, putting obviously is the easiest. Chipping or a bump and run type shot is the next easiest. And finally, pitching or a flop shot is the hardest to execute with the biggest penalty paid for a missed shot. Now, one of the things you hear on television golf coverage a lot is about how a player short-sighted himself. What they mean by that is if you look back here at this green, the left-hand side is the short side, or where you have a lot less green to work with. When we miss to the left-hand side, we're short-siding ourselves. Now, if we miss to the right-hand side, that's the long side. Aim for the right-hand side, because if we miss to the left just 10 or 15 feet here, I might be in the bunker or end up with a pitch shot, which I'm gonna pay a much better, bigger penalty for a poor shot, and it's a harder shot to get close. If I miss 10, 15 feet to the right, I'm still putting. Even 30 feet to the right, I'm still putting. And finally, if I miss 40 or 50 feet to the right, I've got so much green to work with, I can hit that long bump and run type chip shot that we want to have. So when you're next time you're in the fairway, before you approach the green, think about it, look and see where the flag is. The closer it is to the edge, the farther you want to aim towards the middle. And don't short side yourself, and you'll have a much better day around the greens.